Hey guys, um, I kind of thought I would do another review. This time it's going to be a Trekmaster review of something I got yesterday. Um, and it's a Trekmaster item that I've just been dying for. And here he is now. It's nice Trekmaster Ferdinand. The Logging Loco finally got him, and I'm so excited. I, um, he has been out of the box; he's been run, but I, I was able to put him back in, which was kind of cool. Since I kept all the pieces for the box, I was able to put him back in, and so, so he's back in. But we will be taking him out, and he al he already has his battery in him, and he still does. So yeah, um, yeah, it's a uh, Ferdinand, and the thing I like about it is this nice little face, this cool face. It like gives him the uh, Loco's way, since they're crazy. And his little tender, and his red little brake van that's like identical to Bash's, which I have. Hold on, um, let me go get it. Right here, it's exactly the same, just different colors. If you're wondering where the cup, the front coupler is, um, that's the one I. The, it's the one I used for my Thomas model, but I might. I think I'm gonna put it back sometime. I might put it back. Okay. Anyways, now before we now before we um get Ferdinand out um um. In my next video, I might do a review of Truckington Diecast Old Puffer Pete. Um, also got him yesterday along with Ferdinand. I got him with him for about. I got this guy for about seven bucks, and I'll be reviewing him in the next video. Anyways, now let's get Ferdinand out of the box. Now, like I said, he's already been out of the box. He's already been run, so it'll be easy to get this guy out. And he's out. And so, yeah. Um, yeah, Ferdinand. Um, Tender doesn't have to be connected to work. It's for me with that. Hmm. Here is Ferdinand with his tinder. Um, and here's his little red bright van. I don't know if it's red or orange because um, it, it looks like a reddish orange color. I, I, I might call it a red orange color. And, and, Put that on. That is the whole entire Ferdinand train. No. Hold on, I gotta go get my screwdriver. There he goes. Oh. Yep, he was right about the head socket of where you put the battery in his head. So, yep. And so yeah, that's Ferdinand. What I find is that something to know is that Ferdinand would be cool if he came with another set of logs. I, I agree with the guy who did the, that other guy who did the review of him. I agree with him if that it would be cool if he came with another set of logs. But it might but I think he was right that it would have made his packaging a little different. Ferdinand's, and so yeah, um, so, it would, yeah, it would have been cool if he did, because, like, um, now, um, because, one thing for sure, you can take all the ones that, both flatbeds that Dash has, because in the movie, he wasn't carrying any, only 
Ferdinand was, and Bash was, and so was Thomas. But Dash himself wasn't, but he just came with two flatbeds. But I think I have all the characters for a remake except Captain. I have to get a lot more engines, like Edward, Diesel 10, Diesel, um, what else do I need? Uh, Captain, of course. I don't know if I said Captain already. Because I do need Captain. And I need he I have Hero already, I forgot. I was about to say that I need Hero, but I'm like, wait a minute, I already have Hero. Okay, no. Just hold on a second, let me go get Bash and Dash. And here they are. Now I have all three of the locos. Now, also, um, the guy who did the review of Ferdinand, he was right. Um, Ferdinand's face is smaller than Bash and Dash's. But, I don't know. So, but who cares? I mean, I have all three locos. Um, if I get every engine that was in Misty and Rescue, I might do a remake of it. And, um, for the part when they go th to, to, I mean, <sighs> through the tunnel to Sodor, um, Dash won't be carrying any. Uh, Fernand, um, the red, the red flatbed. The, um, Bash will be carrying the blue flatbed. Thomas, uh, Hold on. Thomas, um, he'll be carrying this thing. I don't know why. It, it, just because it came with the log. He'll be carrying that car. But, see, that completes the review of Checklist of Ferdinand. Hope you enjoyed it.